that I want you to start from my local government. That's why I'm here. That's why I want us to you know anything we can do to help our young people in this year about the not. I am so down for it. Seriously, as you continue with your school work, with your personal profession, with your side hustle, just remember that you can key in to the digital economy. My name is Anyedi Dobong, and I currently work as a community manager for Google's developers in Africa. I'm one of the people who I would say put together the vision for this event, and I'm partnering with my very good friend Daniel and there are a lot of other ecosystem partners to bring to this um, community Isia Langwa Tech Day. My name is Mercy Kwe, I'm from Aquaibom State and um, I came to these events as a speaker and also part of the community. I'm a software engineer at um, PHP Sandbox. So well, my name is Honorable Ezechikam Nayo Jubilee. I am the Deputy Chairman of Umununochi Local Government in Abia State. I, I think we need to have more programs like this in our local government. And if we can continue with events like this, if we can also structure them well, if we can make sure that we implement them consciously. In the next five years, I see our local governments, you know, with young people who are tech savvy, doing businesses in their local regions and reaching a market and an audience all over the world because that is what tech has the ability to do. Tech allows you to be able to reach anybody in the world from the comfort of your, of your room. How I feel about today's event is I feel very happy seeing a lot of young people here and seeing the innovations that IG Hub and all its partners who have also partnered with you know, the organization to bring this event to life is doing here in rural communities. And the best way to get all of these young people to get actively involved is when we can get them involved at a very, very young um, age. Yes, this tech day is a very great one indeed. The lecture that I have today, I am happy. Yes, we are hearing about techniques, technology, technology, basic tech, and so, so, so. Today, it has come to my mind that it is the organization of knowledge for all purposes. In this program, I have been interested in it. I just want to say big thank you to those that organize it. Well, the event is a very worthwhile. I think it is, a, is, it is so, so, so good that uh, the, the, the organizers have made our time to capture young people. Because these young people are the people of the future. And technology is the hope of the future. And so I think it is very worthwhile. My name is T.C. Barra. I am the voice on the radio, Flow 94.9 FM. And the whole idea here is to create an awareness in the minds of children at that age to start thinking beyond the environment. Yes, there's no internet, they don't have a lot of computers, but then can we start a spark that would make someone think beyond the box and then we might have the new, uh, would I say, the next Elon Musk or the next Bill Gates or the next Mark Zuckerberg. Who knows? It could come from my village, Isialangwa. It could come from my local government, Isialangwa, or any of the 774 local government areas in Nigeria where this event is going to be going to. I'm really excited. I want to be a part of it all the way and take part, you know, to see it progress and grow. Thank you. Okay.